Hi, welcome back to the Angular and Spring Boot CRUD tutorial. In this video, we're going to create a REST endpoint for deleting the expense. So let's begin. Let's go to the Spring Tool Suite and let's go to the expense service and quickly declare a method for deleting the expense. So void, I'm going to call this delete. And to this, we're going to pass the ID, which is the expense ID, and I'm going to call this ID. So let's save this and now if you go to the implementation class, we need to override the method. So let's override the method and let's quickly get rid of these comments. And first we need to get the expense object. So for that, we're going to make use of this find by ID method. This is going to return the expense object. So let's quickly create, call the find by ID method, find by ID. And to this, we're going to pass the ID. This is going to return the expense object and I'm going to call this expense and then we are going to make use of the expense repository to call the delete method expense repository dot delete and you can see to this delete method we're going to pass the expense entity and we're going to pass this expense object and let's save this so now the service method is ready for deleting the expense. All we need to do is we need to call this service method inside our controller. Let's do that. Let's go to the expense controller. Uh, let's quickly take this and paste it in the down and let's change the bits that are required. So let's change this to delete mapping because we are making a delete request. So delete mapping and I'm going to keep it as it is like slash expenses slash ID and we're going to get the ID and uh, let's change the method name to delete and then we are going to make use of the expense service to call the delete method so let's get rid of this and call the delete method and to this delete method we are going to pass the ID so this will not return anything let's remove that and we are going to return actually a string which is nothing but the response we are going to return a string which is expense is deleted successfully you can give any name like any text you want so I'm just uh, writing returning this re as a response expense is deleted successfully and also I'm going to send the HTTP status okay so let's quickly change this to string and let's import the delete mapping okay so let's save this so now we have uh, the delete mapping rest endpoint let's test our work so let's go to the postman and first let's make a get request for all the expenses okay so now we have four records let's actually try to delete the the third one which is macbook air so what I'll do is let's specify the ID slash expenses slash three and let's change this to delete. And when I click on this send, you can see the response expense is deleted successfully. So now when I make a get request for slash expenses, we should expect three records. You can see now we have three records, the object three, the ID three has been deleted. Okay, so now we have the rest endpoint for deleting the expense. All we need to do is make a request to this rest endpoint from our, from our Angular application. So that we're going to do in our next video. I will see you in the next video.